This movie is about David and his sister Ollie and his friend being brought to a strange world and a strange part of the island what they did not know a lot about. These are their stories. The rainstorm woke up Sarah. Sarah was awake. She was upset. She was scared of the rain. Dear Beasley, this is Sarah. Sarah, are you okay? Sarah said, I'm scared of the rain. I really was scared. Dear said, don't be scared of the rain. Just try to go to sleep. Sarah said, okay. I'll, go, I'll try to go to sleep. David, thank you. It basically was the next day and it was a lovely day. The sun was shining brightly that day. Like you said, they got up and they got dressed. They had breakfast and later. David went outside. David basically noticed a ball of water shore on the beach, probably from the storm last night in the park. So what he was going to do is he was going to pick it up and look inside. He basically looked inside the bottle, and he noticed that there was a piece of paper in the bottle. He pulled the paper out, and it looked like a treasure map. So he decided to ask his friends if it would be in her head going on a treasure hunt. Okay, he basically told his friend and his sister who was in her head going on a treasure hunt, and they said they were into her going on a treasure hunt. It sounded like fun. So that's what they were going to do, pack everything out and go on a treasure hunt. They basically followed the treasure map and it led up to a path of a mountain. They decided to go up that path, hoping that they would find the treasure and that's what they decided. The treasure map led them to on top of the mountain. There was no treasure. Jackie said, David, do you think this is the treasure? This beautiful sunset on on top of the mountain? David said, I think it is the treasure. The treasure is the, a sunset. Peter basically said to David, how are we going to get back home on his night time? David said, I guess we could camp here tonight. Jackie said, David, that's a good idea. Let's camp here. Okay, it was the next day. By the time they got back home, it was the afternoon. So they decided just to hang out a bit until it was dinner time. They basically were hanging out in the lounge and they were talking about how weird a deal they got with that treasure. That treasure wasn't money or jewelry or gold, it was a sunset. That's basically the way it went. See, Joey's mom said, guys, it's time for dinner. And they said, okay, we're coming for dinner. 
Oh yeah, this is basically where this we end for now.